Hi, I'm Anna. I'm a fluid artist. Today I'm going to be doing a fun commission. It's going to be a round charcuterie board with a resin design on part of it and then part of the wood showing. It'll be mostly whites with some golds. I think it'll be really elegant and fun. I hope you enjoy. I'm starting with some clear resin here and putting it into mixing cups. I've got some white mica powder, which will be my base. For this tray, here's some white fluid pigment from Pebio and some pink, very light pink mica powder. And I left a clear cup as well. There's the fluid pigment in gold, which I ended up not using because it was too green looking. Up in the right hand corner is the inspiration for this piece, but the client wanted um, more of the wood showing and just more white color overall. So we're gonna see if we can achieve that for her today. I'll list all the materials I used in the description below. I'm just using the mixing stick to blend. And you see I've got the coaster mold set up here. I love doing coasters and a board at the same time so I can coordinate a set and also I typically have some um, leftover resin when I'm doing a border a tray and so then I can just use that up on however many coasters it covers. So I'm just adding more and more layers, blending them out with the heat gun, popping the bubbles. And let's get some of these coasters filled here. Now you see that I've laid on some crushed glass onto the board. And it's the second day. Um, I'm going in with another layer. It wasn't, it didn't look very white. It was um, too transparent. So I wanted it to look more white, their color to be richer and more opaque. So we're going in with another layer and we're gonna add on some gold as well. I put a heavier concentration of the white fluid pigment in also to make it more opaque. And I'm dripping on, the gold I used was um, an alcohol ink, Jacquard Brass, Jacquard Pinata, a brass color, it's one of my favorites. And I put that on the spot with the crushed glass and then just um, dragging it through a little bit through the rest. And these two coasters here, I'm going to make these to coordinate with this board. I'm using the torch to pop the bubbles and I'm just going to prop up the tray a little bit because I see that my resin is um, kind of drifting to one side. I'm also adding crushed glass, crushed glass to the coasters as well. Okay, time to remove the tape, and I use the torch to help me do this. It, so it loosens and softens the resin so I can peel it right away. And I have a video on how to do this little trick in detail. I'll put that up on the screen. And then I took a little gold leaf marker and I'm going in with some fine details to add 
with some interest. And I used a thicker gold leaf marker for that edge. And a few days later, this is the finished result. I had so much fun making this piece and I think it turned out just gorgeous and based on the client's reaction I think she really liked it too. And I'd love to hear what you think just leave me a note in the comments and also if you like this video hit thumbs up and I'd love to have you as a subscriber on the channel. I really appreciate being able to do what I love and share it with you. Take care. God bless.